Let's verify Lagrange mean value theorem for fx equal to x squared plus 3x plus 2 in the interval 1 comma 2. First step we need to show that function is continuous. F being a polynomial function is continuous. Again, f being a polynomial is differentiable. f being a polynomial is differentiable. Not only that, we can even compute x square derivative of x square is 2x, derivative of 3x is 3, derivative of 2 is 0, so the derivative equal to 2x plus 3. Therefore, Lagrange mean value theorem is applicable. Therefore, Lagrange theorem let us write just Lagrange theorem. Lagrange theorem is applicable. So, if we want to apply Lagrange theorem, we need the function to be continuous and differentiable. We got it. Oh, continuous in, since it is continuous throughout R, in particular it is continuous on the closed interval 1 comma 2. Differentiable we just need in the open interval 1 comma 2. Now, if the Lagrange theorem is applicable, let us apply it. By Lagrange mean value theorem, let us just write MBT for Lagrange mean value theorem. By Lagrange mean value theorem, there exist exist a constant C such that such that F dash C equal to F B minus F A divided by B minus A. What are A and B? They are the in point of the interval. Of course, again C has to be greater than A less than B. A and B are the interval. Here, in this question, f x equal to x square plus 3x plus 2. So, we can find f dash x. You differentiate it. x square you will get 2x. 3x if you differentiate just 3. What about a and b? a is the starting point of the interval. We are starting from 1 and ending at 2. So, 1 comma 2 a equal to 1 b equal to 2. a equal to 1, b equal to 2. Therefore, f of a equal to f of 1 equal to 1 square plus 3 into 1 plus 2, 3 plus 2, 5, 5 plus 1, 6. f of 2, b equal to 2, now f b equal to f of 2 that is equal to 2 square plus 3 into 2 plus 2. 3 into 2 is 6, 6 plus 2 is 8, 8 plus 4 is 12. Okay. Therefore, there exists a constant c such that f dash c instead of x we should write c 2c plus 3 equal to f of b is f b minus f a divided by b minus a f of b is 12 minus 6 divided by b minus a 2 minus 1 12 minus 6 is 6 6 by 1 is 6 
Now, can you solve for such a constant c? Lagrange's theorem guarantees such a constant c. In fact, in this case, we can explicitly solve. If you take 3 to the right hand side, you will get 6 minus 3, that is 3. And if you take 2 to the other side, you have 3 by 2 or 1.5. Is 1.5 greater than 1? Yes, 1.5 is greater than 1 and less than 2. 1.5 lie between the end point of the interval 1 and 2. 1.5 lie between A and B 1 and 2. And is F dash of 1.5? Oh, I made a mistake. Yeah, okay. F dash of, I did a big mistake. F dash of 1.5 equal to f b minus f a divided by 2 minus a that we computed is equal to 6. Is that equal to 6? Yes. 2 into 1.5 is 3. 3 plus 3 is 6. Well then, we have determined such a constant c such that f dash c equal to f b minus f a by b minus a and c lie between 1 and 2. So, we have verified Lagrange mean value theorem for this particular case whereby function was x square plus 3x plus 2 in the interval 1 comma 2.